Hey, how you doing? Justin here. Today we're going to do a beginner play along for I Belong To You by Lenny Kravitz. Really great song if you've just learned your minor chords. It's just an A minor and an E minor chord for the whole song. There's lots of different approaches to the rhythm because the chords are so simple. You can literally, if you're a beginner, just be doing strum, one strum per bar. You could do two strums per bar. You can do 16 strums per bar if you want to get all fancy with it. Lots of different ways of approaching it. I'm going to play through it now, start real simple, and then try a few different strumming patterns so you can kind of get a bit of a vibe on what you might like to try out yourselves. Uh, it really is just those two chords with real simple strumming, so I don't really feel like I need to do much more of a lesson on it. Uh, hopefully you've learned those chords as part of my beginner course. So uh, let's just fire it up. So I hope you got some ideas there of the many possibilities that you can explore with your rhythm guitar. It's a really important part of the beginner's journey is learning to explore different rhythm patterns and trying to get a feeling 
for what the right pattern is because often in a tune like this there's not really a kind of a, a proper strummy pattern there are multiple layers of electric guitar on the original recording the things that you might like to try out if you're a fan of that but if you're a beginner guitar player they're probably going to be a bit beyond you at this stage so just trying to figure out what strumming pattern makes me feel good when I'm playing this tune it's a really really important step along the journey do remember that over on the app there are hundreds more songs like this all graded for beginners at different levels with using different chords it's a load of fun you can change the key the original recording, by the way, uh, if you want to play along with the original record, you'd need to put on a capo at the third fret. So it's still the same chords, the A minor to E minor, but the capo will put you in the right key. And if that's the best key for your voice, remember that you can use the capo feature in the app as well. If you've got any problems with this song, do remember there are lessons for each element over on the beginner's course on the website and check out the app. There's going to be a link below. It's available for iOS and Android and it's loads of fun. Great ratings. Check them out for yourself and you'll get a bit of a vibe on what's going on with that. I'll see you for plenty more guitar lessons very soon. You take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.